long as pro-democracy protesters tried to retake a major road outside government headquarters and circling police. Officers pushed protesters back with pepper spray. They arrested dozens. Police officials, meanwhile, promising to investigate six officers who were captured on video by a local TV station taking a democracy protester behind a building to kick him during the street clearing operation. Manisha Tank is there with us uh, in Hong Kong live with the very latest. What can you tell us, Manisha? Yeah, well, as you say, we saw these clashes overnight. What police are trying to do is retake these areas, in particular behind me, that's an eight-lane highway. It's normally full of traffic, uh, and it's caused severe disruption, the fact that a lot of these, off these roads have been off-limits, Christine. Uh, so the police have had this incremental step-by-step -step approach over the last few days. Uh, apart from the use of tear gas two weeks ago, we've seen great restraint from the police, but what we saw overnight was, as you say, the use of pepper spray, they say, to help disperse the crowds and get them to move away from those barricades so they could actually take them down. Uh, but yes, this video has now emerged, which is raising some serious questions, Christine, about the police and their conduct. Indeed, and that video is certainly making the rounds of pro-democracy uh, activists. Thank you so much for that, Mr. Tank in Hong Kong for us this morning. All right, it's quarter past the hour right now. We're going to have much more on our...